Dog Loves Books by Louise G Yates. Dog loved books. He loved the smell of them. He loved the feel of them. Dog loved books so much, he decided to open his own bookstore. He unwrapped, unpacked, and stacked the books ready for grand opening. When the day of the grand opening finally came, Dog had a bath, dried his fur, blew his nose, and threw open the door to greet his new customers. But there was no one there. So Dog tried to keep busy. And then a lady came into the store. I'll have a tea with milk and two sugars, she said. I'm sorry, said Dog, but this is a bookstore. I only sell books. The lady walked out. Dog was alone. He waited and waited. Then a man came into the store to ask for directions. When he left, Dog was downhearted, but not for long. He wouldn't wait a moment more. Dog fetched a book from the shelf and began to read. When he read, he forgot that he was waiting. When he read, he forgot that he was alone. When he read, he forgot that he was in the bookstore. And when one adventure ended, Dog simply took another book down from the shelf. And a new adventure began. So Dog was somewhere else altogether when a customer came into the store to ask for a book. Dog knew exactly which ones to recommend. Dog loves books. But most of all, he loves to share them. <laughs>